I will now proceed to tell you <clears throat> the story of the first time I got insanely drunk off hard liquor. This is you might have been there, man. Really? You might have been there. I actually as I tell the story, you tell me if you came. I'm not sure. Oh, that's what she said. <laughs> <laughs> not that kind of come. <laughs> um so first of all, let me just state for the record, Your Honor, that <laughs> I fucking I I hate hard liquor. Same. With a passion. Same. And I know, like, the manly thing is the opposite of that, right? The manly thing is, oh, oh. give me some Jack Daniels, bro. Give me some fucking Jim Bean, bro. Fuck That's what that. I want, bro. It's like, nah, give no. Give me sex on the beach that tastes sweet and good. I'll have that. <laughs> yeah, too. I mean, it's a well-known fact that, like, the the fruity so-called girly drinks are delicious. Yeah. I mean, they're made to taste like high C. Yeah. And everybody likes high C. Yeah. Some, yeah. They, so people who, who lie about that, they're liars. Like, unless you're, like, a... A uh, sixty-five-year-old man or older, and you look grizzled, and yeah. you look like you fucking fought in Vietnam and shit. Then it's like, okay, you, yeah, Jack Daniels is for you, or like old grandpa. You remember that shit? There was that whiskey on my birthday. That like, oh they yeah, found it, it, it wasn't like old the, grandpa. It was something else. It was like yeah, it was like old. It was like something grandpa. Yeah, or some weird <laughs> shit. yeah, it had some name like yeah, don't drink like, this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Brown, don't drink this <laughs> sauce juice. <laughs> All so, right, my bad. We sidetracked on your story. So I hate, I just hate, I hate hard liquor. Mm -hmm. But when I was young, I didn't really know that I hated it because I never really had it. Mm -hmm. I never had it in a serious way. So at the time, I forget how old we were. It was my first time seriously drinking heavy with hard liquor. It was probably like 10th grade or some shit like that, mm -hmm. right? Now, I, I had, you know, had drinks before, but they, it was beer. And it was like wine a little bit, Some like champagne, champagne and shit like that, which I thought was okay, which mm -hmm. I liked. So it was New Year's Eve, and I was like, you know what, fuck it, I'm going to have hard liquor tonight. Mm -hmm. We went to uh, Andrew Cohen's house. It was me, Henry, and a bunch of other people. Mm -hmm. Stop me if you think you were there. You might have been there. Or maybe not. I really don't remember. Maybe. I, I don't know Henry was one of the ones who was definitely there. I couldn't tell you what I did yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> I can't either, but I can tell you what, what this night was oh, yeah. like, which tells you a lot about it. <laughs> so we show up there, and dude, I start, like, I fucking turn into Van Wilder, right? Mm -hmm. Like, I'm like, I'm looking around, everybody's got all this different hard liquor, and it just looked appealing to me that night. That's why I tried, because there were so many different kinds, mm -hmm. and it was like, oh, this looks cool. Like, yeah. I want to try all these different ones. This is such a good advertisement for for moderation, by the way, this entire story. <laughs> Because I, you know, I was a fucking moron, right? So I, I'm like, all right, let me just start. I see people taking shots. I'm like, let me have a shot of that. Let me have a shot of that. Let me have a shot of that. Mind you, the entire time, I'm not, like, I don't like it. Like, yeah. I'm just doing it, yeah, you know? Yeah. Like, it burns. I'm like, yeah, I'm not sure I really like this. It's all in a short it. span, right? So oh, in such a yet. short span of time. Oh, that's Dude, the worst. I take 11 shots in like a 30 minute time span. Terrible. And this is how fucking stupid I am. Like, I j was just uneducated about it, yeah. which is a danger for kids drinking, which is why you need moderation and you need education. Uh -huh. You need t to teach kids shit, and they weren't teaching us shit, yeah. right? Yeah, they're showing and us I was just an idiot. masturbation or something, but not liquor. They didn't really, I figured that out at a young age. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, so I don't feel, I don't feel, I don't feel, and that's why I kept taking more and more shots. Mm -hmm. Son. Smacked you. I started, uh, we, uh, Henry says, hey, we're going to go to this other, uh, this other place, right? Kid named Richie's house. Mm -hmm. Last name starts with an M. I won't say it on yeah. there, even though I said Andrew's name. Sorry, Andrew. But there's a lot of Andrew Cohen's that probably nobody knows who the fuck I'm talking about. <laughs> um, so we go to, uh, get, we get in the car. Mm -hmm. First of all, when we leave the house, right, we go out the back door, we walk around the front. That's when it hit me. Like, as soon as I opened the door to walk outside, it was like a fucking ton of bricks. Like Muhammad Ali or that dude who fought last night just punched you. Deontay the Wilder. Face. By the way, props to the champ, son. <laughs> that, that fight was awesome, and he's, he's a beast. So, uh, we, so we started walking to the car. I swear to you, I made a fucking figure eight in the straight line to the car. I was like, uh, falling all over the place and shit. And I love how... Nobody noticed. Like, really? No, like that's how, that's so such a high school thing to happen. Like, you, somebody's fucking beyond hammered, and everybody just acts like, "Nice, no, good." Oh, I guess it's beyond hammer. Right? Yeah. It's fine. You know, it doesn't matter. It's natural. Right? Yeah. <laughs> so I'm fucking falling all over the place. I sit in, sit in the back of the car. We're driving, dude. I'm so fucked up. Right. Oh, the worst feeling. It, worst feeling. So we get to this kid's house, and we're just standing in front, relaxing. At the time, I was smoking because I thought I was cool, and smoking a cigarette. Bunch of people around me and stuff. 
and they're having a conversation. I couldn't tell you what it's about because I'm so beyond hammered, right? I remember this, even though I was super hammered, but then other people, of course, will remember it, and they'll tell you in more vivid detail than I could, right? But I look at them, and they say, you looked stone sober. Like, you looked crazy sober, mm -hmm. like just normal day Kyle, right? Mm -hmm. I look at them, and I say this. Yo, I'm about to throw up. <laughs> And they're like, all right, well, if you give, go to the bushes right there, man. Like, they're pointing to something like 20 feet away. It's uh -huh. right there, right? And I go, nah, I'm good. <laughs> and then I go, <laughs> projectile vomit, son, uh -huh. right in the middle of the street. Uh -huh. Just, <laughs> it looked like the fucking exorcist. Like, <laughs> like powerful yeah. stream of vomit right yeah. in the middle of the street. And I'm like... Yo, Richie, I'm sorry. Because they're like right in front of his house. Yeah. It's horrible. I'm like, his mom's going to see it. Man, nice Richie! <laughs> what were you doing outside? I see the vomit in the street, Richie. Is that my pasta from last <laughs> night? <laughs> Looks like my so, pasta. The story gets better. So uh, we get uh, we get in the car, and they're, they're going to go somewhere else. I tell them, I'm like, you guys got to drop me off at home, man. Yeah. By the way, you want to see how much of a fail this was? What? The time was like... 10.45, 11, 10 or some yeah. shit before midnight yeah. on New Year's Eve. So I just, I, fuck, I was such a bitched out move, right? Like, I look like a punk bitch, right? Uh -huh. So uh, they drive me back to my house. When I go to get into my house, it it was like a scene from a, from a movie or some shit because everybody's like, yo, man, like, let me help you to the door or whatever. I'm like, oh, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> I open the, I open the car door. I start walking. Uh -huh. I'm like, keep it together, keep it together. As they're pulling away, like they pull away, I like collapse and start like crawling to the door. <laughs> I'm like, <laughs> I open the door. Right uh -huh. now, thankfully, nobody was home. Mm -hmm. Thankfully, everybody was out like celebrating in my family and shit. So I open the door. By the took me like an hour to fucking get my key yeah. in. I'm like hitting this. I'm like, oh, okay, this is never gonna happen. And I probably considered giving up at one point. Like, oh, I'll like just sleep. Yeah. I'll just sit down out here or some shit. No. So I get in somehow. Mm -hmm. Literally crawl upstairs. Crawl up my stairs. Mm -hmm. The entire time thinking to myself, I'm gonna you're die. fucking crawling right now. Oh. Are, you, are you crawling right now? What? Wow, you're crawling right now. Uh -huh. So I I get in my bed. First of all, I drag my. Uh, my garbage pail next to me if I have to keep Smart throwing move. up the rest of the night. Yeah. Um, and I have no recollection of throwing up the rest of the night, but in the morning I look over, there's vomit in the yeah, thing. Yeah, of course. The, the best part of the story. You ready for this? It, again, this is like out of a fucking movie. Mm -hmm. Like super bad or some shit. <laughs> so now, in order to tell you the rest of the story, I have to rewind to like a week or two weeks earlier. <laughs> I was uh, uh, very good friends with... Uh, is this kid Jose? Mm -hmm. You remember Jose? Yeah, of course. Nice guy, great guy. Me and him were uh, super close. Uh -huh. And Jose, uh, women really liked Jose. They loved him. And he had introduced me to this girl who was friends with the girl that he was seeing and kind of kicked off a little bit. And we exchanged numbers and we hung out a few times. Now, nothing happened yet at that point. But something could have, like, so it was developing, right? We could have, you know, had a nice little high school fling thing going on, right? Mm -hmm. So I'm laying in bed, beyond hammered, drunkest I've ever been in my life. And he calls me. I'm like, what the fuck? I answer. I don't know why I answer. I usually wouldn't answer in that situation. But I answered. And he says, yo, you remember that girl you met the other night? And I'm like, yeah. And mind you, she... From what I remember, she was super hot, right? Mm -hmm. He's like, yo, she wants to fuck you. I'm like, really? <laughs> He's like, right now. <laughs> I'm like, nah. <laughs> I'm on the phone, son. Said no? I, I couldn't, I couldn't. I was fucking oh. beyond hammer laying in my own filth and oh. just... Oh my! It was like that entire night was like a movie, man. It was like a movie. That probably turned you into a rock star, like in her eyes. Like, yo, like what? He just rejected me like that? Well, yeah, maybe I don't know. You but know? because I don't, he didn't, I, he didn't know the story. I couldn't tell the story, so he probably thought I was doing something else. But I was fucking hammered and yeah, I know. But so you weren't there this night then. I thought you might have been there in the car the entire time. No, I don't think so. 
Man, I mean, I, I could have been. I just don't, I don't fucking remember. Yeah, no, I think you would have remembered me throwing up. You would have remembered that. Like, my projectile vomiting in front yeah. of Richie's house. The only projectile environment I remember is from my love you, man. <laughs> oh, I thought you were going to say one from me, a different one no. from me. I don't throw up often, so. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, man, that sounds terrible. Yeah. That's a good story, though, right? It's one yeah, of my, that's good. I was thinking about the Do you other remember night. any, is it any, spe- was it any specific liquor that you look at now and you're still like. All of them. Oh, the right. only one that I could tolerate, and when I say tolerate, I mean tolerate. Uh-huh. Like, I could take a little bit, but I still can't have a lot of it. Vodka. It's those damn Russians. They they slip yeah. through somehow. But all the other ones. I don't like tequila. I don't like rum. Oh. I don't like whiskey. I like none of that shit. Yeah. 